everyone welcome to today's vlog i just finished getting ready i don't really feel like dressing up today because it's actually like 64 degrees outside my mom and i are going to the farmer's market so i'm just wearing something kind of sporty i also cut my hair i didn't mention it in my last few vlogs that i posted i am gonna go pick up my mom and we're gonna go to the farmer's market i need to take some pictures today do some content and clean some stuff around the house i also need to go to sephora and get a new Too Faced lip injections glass because I lost mine. It literally fell out of the bottom of this zipper. That's unfortunate, but it was almost gone anyway, so it's fine. I was talking to my friend Ashley this morning, Ashley Taylor here on YouTube. If you guys know who she is, I'm sure you do. If not, what are you doing? Go watch her, love her to death. Her and I were talking about that infamous ghost rug from Marshalls, TJ Maxx, Home Goods, whatever. And I found one last night at TJ Maxx. They actually had like three or four of them. So I bought one. Oh, my necklaces are backwards. I need to fix that. So I bought one and uh, she was like, can you please go look for one? So I'm going to go see if they still have one and then I'll ship it to her if they do. So TJ Maxx, Sephora, Farmer's Market. And that's it. I know everyone and their mom talks about the Glossier U perfume. It's amazing. I love it. Okay, let's go. Hi everyone, I just got home and I've had kind of a long day. It's almost six o'clock and we went to lunch at this pizza place called Blackbird and we had a margarita pizza and then we went to Botanical Brothers, which is a new plant store in town. I didn't get anything there. I didn't get anything at the farmer's market either, just a drink. And then, where did we go next? Barnes and Noble. I ended up getting just a coffee and a few different books. First is Layla by Colleen Hoover. Next is The Woman in the Window, which apparently is soon to be a motion picture. Didn't know that, by AJ Finn. And I Told You This Would Happen by Elaine Murphy. And then I went to Target. I already put my groceries away actually. I just got like salsa, chips, pasta sauce, milk, things like that. Just like essentials for making random meals, miscellaneous meals. Also went to Ulta, I got a replacement of my um, Too Faced Lip Injection Extreme Gloss that I lost. <laughs> and then what else did I do? I also went to TJ Maxx and got the Ghost Rug for Ashley, which I'll show you guys what it looks like. I'm not gonna open it until closer to spooky season. I usually start decorating in September. I'm sure you guys have seen this rug on TikTok. It just has these cute little ghosts all over it. And then I got an affiliate package from Caraway, which is a home brand. They sell like pots and pans, cookware, things like that. I got the cookware set in the color cream. I'll show you guys when I unbox it a little later. It comes with storage, a fry pan, a saucepan, saute pan, and a Dutch oven. So it comes with a lot of pieces, so I'm really excited for that. And then, and then I have a few things that I wanted to show you from miscellaneous stores. I got this little Life is Good mug and it has a golden retriever on it with a witch hat. And it says, every treat you make, every sweet you bake, every bite you take, I'll be witching you. 
I was influenced. I got it. I also bought a microfiber towel for yoga. I actually met a subscriber at a country concert. She invited me to go to hot yoga with her. I have never been so sweaty in my entire life. I, it literally looked like I took a shower. I was so sweaty. So thanks Chelsea for inviting me, but literally so hard. Such a difficult workout. I was supposed to go to Denver for a bachelorette party, but I'm unable to go actually because of some family things and also like Winnie. We were supposed to dress in like 70s theme, so I bought this little set on Amazon. I think it's so cute. Just kind of like abstract prints with funky colors. Unfortunately, I won't be able to wear it there, but I'm sure I can find another occasion to wear it. But here's the funky little shirt and it has kind of like a satin collar. And then I also bought this little sweat set from, I think it's Skylar Grace Co. Ooh, I don't know for sure. There's no tags on it, but anyway, they're just like cream joggers and it says slow down. And then the actual hoodie says slow down once in a while. And then the front is just plain. I'm going to Nashville in two weekends and I'm gonna wear that on the flight because I have, I have a really late flight. To Nashville so I'm gonna wear that there. I also got a package from this sheet company. I believe the brand is pronounced Hervé. I think it's Hervé because it says sleep happily Hervé after but they are so soft. I'm really excited to wash these and sleep on them. They are bamboo and zinc bedding. So thank you Hervé for sending those over. Victoria's Secret also had the 10 for 38 sale going on. So I bought some underwear, but no one cares about that. So last thing I'm gonna show, I had a gift card to Lane 201, which is one of my favorite boutiques. So I bought a pair of boots for Nashville. I'm not entirely sure how much I love them in person, but they were really cute online. Hopefully these look cuter on, but I'm just like not obsessed with them in person. I'm not a country Western gal, not my style at all. So it's just a little out of the comfort zone for me. I just looked in the mirror and I'm not obsessed with them. I might honestly return these because I just don't think it's worth the money. It's just really out of my comfort zone. So I'm gonna clean up here because I just made a mess and then I'm gonna go lay down and take a nap because I'm tired, Winnie's sleeping, passed out on the floor. And then I'm kind of craving a burger for dinner. So I might get a burger from this place called JL Beers for dinner, but we'll see. Talk to you soon. Thank you. 